CSGO 2 is a scam, plain and simple, like by definition. Valve intended to trick each and every one of us. Maybe you don't want to argue semantics, but I do. CSGO 2 was meant to suggest a new Counter-Strike game, like Halo 2, Half-Life 2, hell, even Warzone 2 and Activision sucks. They updated everything and Infinity Ward does it every other year. CSGO had a literal decade, but no, it's like Overwatch 2. Minimal changes where 95% of the budget is marketing. I wouldn't be surprised if if they're paying all these content creators to fake the hype. Maybe an analogy will help. I wanted a new game. I wanted to get laid. But then Valve gives me an over the pants handy like it's better than nothing, I guess. But I'm not super stoked about it. This should scare the shit out of everyone that actually plays games. We're basically saying, let's stop innovation. We'll crank out the same product over and over. I'm happy to announce Valorant 2. At the end of the season, we'll be switching over to Valorant two it'll be on our brand new engine that came out eight years ago it'll feature all the same maps you most likely hate but now they look nicer and by that i mean you can't go on low settings and you have to repurchase every single skin you've ever gotten i can't be the only one that sees this as potentially dangerous in two more years we'll have csgo 3 but now you have to pay 60 dollars to port over all your skins all this is is a money grab bring back all the people that left the game because they were bored of the monotony people sitting on tens of thousands thousands of cases now everyone's coming back to open them maybe buy new cases gift them etc i just bought prime just so i can get ranked and i'm sure i'm not the only one what did they do change the source 2 which was made in literally 2015 up the brightness and make the game look like a ps3 game instead of a ps1 it took them 10 years to make a harbor smoke that regens i barely played csgo but i feel bad for the vets the loyal fans that have played 10 years and were expecting something new and exciting honestly you guys deserve more but we'll see this is just a first look they said movement upgrades so maybe it won't feel like a game made in roblox i'm gonna play it either way because another year of valorant sounds less fun than a play date with jason if you want early access to the beta make sure you follow me on twitter it won't help but still follow me I am